Ever since I was a kid, I just loved seeing snow fall out of the sky. There's just some serenity, some tranquility, and it gives a chance for your mind to clear itself of everything that we get caught up in life. Every ski guide around here has their own little secret garden, and he took us straight there because it was perfect for us, because the sun was out, the snow was fresh, and there was nobody there. It's all about the light. When we're up there, I will ask, can I maybe just go down first? And if there's no serious dangers, then he's happy to do that. And then I'll turn around and I'll wait for the people I'm skiing with to come down, and I'll just then take pictures of them coming down and then continue skiing myself. I don't like to have easy light. I like to test myself. I like to test the lens and the equipment. The light is actually highlighting all the best elements of what's happening when I, or what I'm seeing and feeling there, which is the energy, the dynamics, the subtlety and the crystals floating in the air. Just down here around the corner. The secret garden in St Anton is going places where I cannot go without the help of others. And it's that knowledge that these guides have, who are all great passionate skiers and above all, they just love the mountains. And it's these people who share their love, their passion, their emotion with me, and that is what ignites my photography. The camera will capture the moment that I'm experiencing. It's not something I'm creating, it's just what nature gives me. My photography is very natural, it's of the moment, it's what I feel, what I see, and what I like to share. When you're standing on the top of a ridge and you're looking down and you can see all this clear, clean, fresh powder in front of you, do you just feel alive? Then you just float down as if you're flying. It's the pureness of living, the purity of the air, the purity of the scenery. It's a privilege to be alive and you're there and you, you can enjoy it. There's nothing better than being in the mountains. And it just fills my soul with a lot of hope and happiness.